I'm Dr. Carlos Barrio at Spark Physiotherapy in Alexandria, Virginia. Today, we're going to discuss some of the benefits of trigger point dry needling. Dry needling is a neat adjunct to treatment when uh, we can't focus in on one orthopedic issue that might be causing the pain. As physical therapists, we immediately start to think, well, what can be the cause of the problem here? What might be the thing driving the pain? And then we would test that out. Um, more typically, when someone has a shoulder joint injury, let's say uh, an acromioclavicular joint or a rotator cuff injury, people will say it hurts here, right here when I do this. So when we have these diffuse patterns of pain that are dull in nature, uh, maybe getting a little bit worse, uh, may uh, respond uh, to different positions of the head, neck, or shoulders that don't make sense for a joint injury in that area, that's when we have to start thinking about a myofascial reason for some of the overlap of pain. The needle itself a lot of times is not even perceived by the patient. What I'll tell them is that when I'm locating these trigger points with my fingers, uh, I'm asking them questions about what they're sensing. Uh, is this pain uh, referring into an area where they are uh, kind of feeling a typical sensation of their complaint? Uh, and if so, when we use the actual needle, the pain is not any greater than when I apply my own palpation with my hands. The difference, however, is that when I place that needle inside uh, to that myofascial knot and there is a contraction, there's a dull ache that is associated with the referral pattern and a local ache. That is just a different sensation than myself putting my fingers there. Um, so it's a surprising sensation, it's a deeper ache than they normally can feel because my hands must go through more tissue to get there, um, and it's really acute, very fast, mostly surprising to a lot of people, more so than it is any more painful than any other technique. A typical side effect of dry needling is a soreness. Um, it's a soreness very uh, similar to one that if you would exercise muscles very hard, um, you'd go to move that arm, that leg, your neck, and feel stiff. The motion actually is, uh, is one of the things that we see the most improvement in near immediately. Whereas if someone couldn't side bend their head because of trigger points in some of the muscles of their neck that we were working on, um, you ask them to stand up, we'd measure that side bending again, for example, and then show an improvement. That's a pretty typical response. Um, the pain is dependent upon the body part as well. Uh, some areas of the body, uh, in particular the calves uh, and maybe the hand, hands and feet, uh, can be a little bit more uncomfortable uh, than, let's say, the muscles of the glutes or the, the large muscles of the shoulders. So it does depend on where you're having the treatment done. 